brown bear cub knows how to cool off in the Florida heat as he takes to the pool with his owner. Carl Bovard owns and runs Single Vision, a non-profit wild animal sanctuary he opened nine years ago. As well as two bear cubs, he cares for six tigers, two lions, two cougars, two bobcats and two alligators at the educational facility located in the backyard of his home in Melrose, Florida. And Carl is completely committed to looking after them. I love getting up early in the morning and working all day and working late into the night. If I'm sick, I don't feel good, it doesn't matter these animals, they still need to be cared for. Among the youngest animals he looks after are his two bears, Honey Bear and Bruiser Bear. One of them is a Florida black bear, the other one is a Syrian brown bear. Uh, I've had them for uh, about four months now. I got them when they were eight weeks old. Bottle fed first thing in the morning, so uh, each bear will take uh, about six or seven bottles right after another. Oh, it's bottle time. They're four months old. Uh, they're still on a formula. This is a formula specifically designed for them. It's uh, about 50% 50 50 fat, 30% protein. Um, hasn't been inexpensive feeding these bears. Uh, in the four months, I've gone through over $1,400 worth of formula. But it's what makes them grow up so fast and stay healthy. They are starting on a diet of fruits and vegetables and things like that, but they still love their bottle. And we actually like to keep them on the bottle as long as we can because this really enforces the bond that we're building with them throughout their lifetime. We're like mama, giving them their milk. Hey, honey bear, oh, what's that? They go through the bottles quick. People think it's fun feeding baby bears. It's not that easy. You take some scratches. Once he's done with the bottle, just give him my arm. And he just likes to suckle. Oh, what? Hey, say hi. Oh. <laughs> and after feeding, it's time to cool off. And while Honey Bear is happy to have a drink from the paddling pool, Bruiser wants to get into the big pool for a swim. Come on, Bruce. Come on, Bruzy. Coming in. But it's not just fun and games at Single Vision, as Carl's commitment to looking after all of his animals comes with a desire to educate and inspire others. My goal now is to, you know, to have as many visitors come out here as, as we can. I feel that if we have one guest that comes out here, kid or something, gets a passion for these animals and goes out and becomes a conservationist, you know, I think we've done our job. 